So, um, welcome back to Dark Souls. Hello. This is uh, controller repair. Let me let me demonstrate what the problem is, because we have we have investigated. Oh, also, Gnome is with me for this. I I am I am here for because I moral support I immoral support. So that's that was the sound of the controller plugging in. This uh. is the weapon. Okay, and um, the problem is that. Yeah, oh, get out of there. Let's, come on, find it. Where is it? All there, right. you, there you go. Settings, and then properties. This is the problem. Y rotation. Mm. It is wiggly, and it is maxed, and it makes me look up. Calibrating it, did not work. We, we went through this. Yeah, calibrating right. seems to do all of nothing. Yeah. It's just, it's like, oh, it shows you numbers, and then you're like, all right, well, that's cool. So uh, we're taking the controller apart yeah, and we're gonna... seeing if there's, like, a piece of physical crud in there. So Things do build up uh, goo over this, time. <laughs> this is a uh, part of PC gaming, and I yeah. believe it is, I, f I feel it's part of the experience of Dark Souls here, so... Let's... Everybody has their own controller problems with yeah. Dark Souls, and this is just another unique version of that. Um... That's I got all the screws out and there's no there's no place I can find for my nylon probe to stick in. Wait. Yeah, maybe up here by the buttons. Ah, there hey, we a, go. A a probe. Yep. Nylon probe is is hella useful, man. You got to got to find I, yourself I, one of these. I should. I should I should ob obtain a probe of some sort. Usually I just use like a pencil or something. Nylon probe is is really great. Um, it's especially great for doing um, any any kind of electrical stuff. Yeah, because being <laughs> non-conductive is is pretty cool. Yeah. Pencil when lead is conductive. Yeah. Poking around Every in things. Everyone did that experiment in high school. Or hey, if you draw a heavy pencil line, it'll conduct a charge. Yeah, that's yeah, that's a cool experiment. I hmm, there's something. Ah, come on. Get and out sometimes of there, they yell. clipped. Yeah, it's. I know it's clipped as well as. Um, yeah. So you're watching me, but barely get this thing off. Come Let's on. Let's see if it's anything like a 360 controller, because I've taken a lot of those apart, cleaning them. Ugh. I don't want to force it, but <laughs> I have. I have a little. Oh. Oh, I'm an idiot. Ah. Uh. I know what the problem with uh, with that is. I didn't actually unscrew all the screws. Oh, there so is, man, I am screw. I am just hitting all the all the high notes of idiocy we, tonight. We get to see like a shadow puppet yeah. of you unscrewing that <laughs> of that uh <laughs> that screw. Yeah. Yeah. We can see what's happening even mm. though we don't see it. <laughs> yeah, that's part of the uh, part of the experience too. Let's see, where was that? Okay, so that goes there. <laughs> Well, you know what? I'm glad that uh, I was not able to get it off with two of the screws attached. That means the screws are working. Okay, I'm I'm at a part of my life where I'm googling the the words nylon probe. <laughs> they are leading me to Amazon. Apparently, Apple makes a special nylon probe. It wouldn't why not? surprise me if this that you're seeing there is precisely the same thing. Uh, these ones I'm look flatter. I'm pretty sure that the one I got was from a guy who worked at the Apple store. Oh. Oh, geez. This, like, Actually. mostly popped? Oh, right. Okay, so it's it's held on a little bit by the triggers, so you have to kind of, like... Yeah, they, they, they hook into the there. bottom shell. Yeah, okay. So, ta-da! A thing. What are... What are you talking about, Jens? I can't believe how different Sister Red 2... Oh, yeah. It's a Sister Red 2 stream. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, no. Um, You know what? I could do Sister Red 2, come to think. Okay, time to, time to get out the other bigger screwdriver. Because that one was a long screwdriver, and this one will be large. That's what we want. Stick that in there. So we have... I have to check something else real mm -hmm. quick. Yeah, that fits better. You don't want to use a, a screwdriver that's too small. You'll just yeah, strip you'll the screws, strip them out. and that yep. then you'll then you're ruined. So. Yeah. Unless you have special strip screw removing stuff that never works. 
I do, but it doesn't, so, you know. Yeah. Um, Those are really annoying to get to work. Well, also, it would only work on, like, machines. Like, yeah, well, not any, on anything, if I tr Right. If I, try to, if I try to do it to just this, it will destroy whatever I'm touching, basically. Yeah. Okay. Really, at that point, just uh, bore the screw out. This, I have to be kind of careful. It seems to be still attached by something that I can't see on the other side. So, yeah, I'm like pulling the analog stick and the whole assembly out. <sighs> come on. It's okay. You can you can come with me. It's okay, buddy. We're going on a little adventure. There, let's take those off. Um, mm. I guess my little... Ad oh, what, what the hell was that? Oh, that was my A button. Yeah, don't want to lose those. Yeah, well, that's that's easy enough to put back once I have the thing out. Yeah. What is this actually attached by? Aha! It's attached by these, which I have just detached. Okay, I might have just permanently ruined my thing. Excellent. I doubt that. Well, it doesn't... Permanently... Yeah. If it fits back together, as long I mean, as none of the circuits are sorted out. Right. I mean, the, the quest questionable part is up here. This is the um, connector for the right bumpers, and it's just sort of ah. loose, where the one on the other side is not loose. So I want to... Where's my probe? Oh, there's your probe. Yeah. So, ah, there we go. Okay, it was not stuck in there very tightly, so that's that's a good sign. All right, and that's connected to there. Okay. We're free after 10,000 years. Right, that wasn't too, too terrible. What do we, what do we have here? Oh, the home button. Ha! Yeah, ah. I can set the, to go home, the buttons home button. back in. Um, oh, shoot. Where do they actually go? Um, uh, the Y is on top. Well, B it, is on the outside. The way, that they, the way that they make these, it should actually be impossible to get it wrong. Yeah, they have different slots. Right. So that's that is a mercy. Yeah. I'm, that's how it is with normal 360s. See, that, that I didn't one know doesn't, if it was true. That one doesn't go. Yeah. So that one goes there. This is the X. So you? Oh no. Ugh. Uh, oh, well, X looks like X. Hmm. Ugh. All right, how about here? No. All right, how about here? Anywhere do you fit? There. Yeah. And that I predict only... the next button is going to predict is B. going to fit. Yeah. Well, okay. So let's just leave those there. And now we have this bugger. You. You f son of a bitch. And they should they usually just pop right off. Well, I don't I'm, I'm hesitant to just Hole. Yeah. Let's see what more I it. can I can see. Send in the probes. Yeah. Well. Uh. I was hoping that there would be something like visibly, physically wrong with this. You know. If I had to, if it's anything, it'll just be a little layer of uh, dust and maybe some finger sweat that got in there and made a goo that happens. That does happen. That's a little uncharacteristic of yours, truly. But I have had this for a while. You have you have oils and and sweat on your hands. Yeah, uh, that's that's definitely true. You you need it for your skin not to dry out. A spudger, that is the name of this probe. Is spudger? it having even silly, even sillier word for it? A spudger. Tell me what spudger means, Google. A spudger, sometimes a spludger, oh. <laughs> is a wiring tool used for poking or adjusting small wires. Spludger. Spludge. The most common sp spudger is a black or yellow nylon stick with a metal hook on one end. Yeah, gently tugging at this thing does not pull hmm. it off. Because um, what it should be is a... Little metal shaft right. that is round with one side carved. It should come off. I know. I I don't want to pull harder than I'm pulling, you know. Yeah. Yeah. You don't want to damage the motor 
Aurelia, whatever you call those things. Right, well, it... I mean, it's already damaged if you think about it. Yeah. What if I... What if I hook under you? Cavadal can confirm that I've used the word, the term spudger in a professional environment. Oh. Brazil is offering to bring a controller, but that is not that will not suit. No. Must be prideful in our that's not controller gonna, that, ripping a party. That will never do. Um maybe there I, are directions for this. Hmm. Perhaps. Also I've used I use the word dongle all the time because I love it. <laughs> dongle. Um, what is this? Oh, that's the, those are the internal screws. Let me put these aside in my little screw diagram. Um, hmm, what am I looking for? Nope. Okay, well, let's get that out of here. You don't need to see that. That's that. Mm. Um. Ah, okay. Huh. Get some compressed air. Uh-huh. Shoot air in the holes of the sensors. Oh. You you get to blast it. I don't have compressed air. Hmm. Well, you can blow on it, but I, I don't know how about... Human mouths are disgusting. That, that they might are. Ultimately... That might be wrong. Do bad stuff. Uh, don't need to do that, I don't think. Oh, that would be nice, wouldn't it? Tighten up. I am not concerned about the rumble feature. That's fine. Yeah, rumbles. That is, I that forgot is if you left rumble on or off. Um, hmm. Well, you know what I do have? <laughs> what what do you have, uh, sir? You, you entertain the zoo. I will be back with what I have. Ah, uh, hello, Zoo. I am here for you. I am actually looking up to see if I have any assignments to do right now. So I did not... I, in my vacancy of thought, that is Dark Souls 2, I have completely forgotten what day it is. I thought it was Saturday. Then again, I do that all the time anyways, so maybe it's not actually that special. Oh, what am I looking for? This. Also, fun fact, if you ever become a uh, network guy for a school... Uh, look for anything that isn't Blackboard, because Blackboard likes to uh, crash a lot. So um, don't use it. It's bad. <laughs> I'm an uncle now. Well, I'm not actually an uncle. I may be an uncle. Who knows? You'll have to talk to my sister about that. I want... Uh this web page. Mm. It's you, microcomputer operating systems. You're the one that crashes all the time. I should email my professor saying you have some shit that causes your... Yeah, school's in session until like two weeks into May, dude. They keep you in these, this time around. Maybe I can work for Nintendo if I keep lying. Hmm. KFJ fixing it. Well, KFJ might have a different controller. That would fix the problem. Like, let's see if this page actually loads. Maybe it just doesn't like Chrome. Okay. Should I switch? Oh, hello. I'm back. This is what I got. This is my vacuum. Oh, uh, I would not recommend that at all. Why? Because uh, the air from a vacuum has a static charge in it. A what? Static charge. Oh, what? Whatever. <laughs> the air in a vacuum. Get out of here. It's no. It's 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 because it, uh, it gets pressurized by a mo. Okay, here it comes. <laughs> I don't see any sparks. <laughs> Well, it's your controller, man. We'll see how it goes. It is, and it is fundamentally not working. Yeah, it's already got probs. Maybe... Is this the same controller you, uh... 
you. This is. I'm just making me laugh. <laughs> this is how we is fix the, problems. Is this the one you used to vacuum Medibot with? What? Uh, vacuum Medibot? What? Oh, yeah, you ha! <laughs> <laughs> Maybe your vacuum just brings uh, laughter to everyone who sees it. <laughs> <laughs> I did at one point vacuum Medibot. So, um, let's... I'm going to risk plugging this in. Vacuum ah. has a static charge. Well, it's you, true. That's you why and your Mr. Static Charge. Well, that's why you can't use a regular vacuum to clean the toner out of a printer. They uh, they make well, special I mean, toner, vacuums for that. Toner is directed by electrostatic forces. It's very, yeah. very sensitive to those. This is a freaking... Whatever. <laughs> it's fine. Also, you're not supposed to use vacuums on a computer either, but... Oh, it's probably gosh. fine. I have done that a ton, and it is totally... Oh, that, that light is super bright. I guess that's... Oh, yeah, those are all the black backlights for the little buttons. Yeah. Okay, cute. All right, so next we have to pull up... Um, Hi, many bucks. Control panel again. <laughs> this is very uh, advanced. Also, I hope that you I'm guys still are enjoying at this. Your, uh, I'm still looking at guide fix for the stick pra page. Uh -huh. my Device. No, I don't want the device manager. Wow, I? that actually is very bright. I want devices and printers. I know, right? Isn't it great? Mm -hmm. Like, I love this I, controller. I do. I, I hope I hope it fixes it. Also, I think maybe nope. Mars got just... Uh, nope, that, that did all of nothing. He's <sighs> experiencing the same... Yeah, well, I mean, it still works. I guess that's a good sign. Yeah, we have not ruined our controller, but... Mm. I mean, I could tap it with the vacuum again. So does the stick just not come off? I, I don't know if it comes off. Let me, let me check. I'm also going to unplug it again. My, uh, oh, there you go. Uh, checking the page. I close that. And then pop it back out. Okay. Yeah, my Skype thing, video froze, who cares? I'm not looking at anything exciting right now anyways. Hey, it's working now, maybe. Hmm. Like hell, maybe the maybe the solution is use a different controller exclusively for this game. Or any game that requires you to Use the right stick to control a camera. That would be a miserable solution. Man. It'd be pretty lame. Especially if it depends on what your other controller is available are. Yeah, well, I mean, I, I got this so that I wouldn't need to get a different Xbox controller. And one yeah. that I could use on the computer. This was like, it was bloody ideal. Have you used this on a console? I haven't. I mean, it, you can... Actually, you no, can. Yeah, yeah, I have. You have? Huh. I have. I wonder about that. Maybe the Xbox is just better about that. It's Maybe like, it yeah. is. Um, it could be a driver issue. <laughs> That's still Beautiful. something that I don't well, think we I mean, really have the capacity yeah. to explore. Oh, a YouTube video for how to remove it. Oh, man. Glorious. Ten minutes long. That lady is running. Guys, what's up? This is um, Azure here. Um, <laughs> Great. So a lot this guy's making the same video you are. Except he doesn't have a Recto Skilled Mage mouse pad. I know! Right analog stick. I guess, like, as you see here, this is the Anza motherboard. But, um, oh, he's taken his more apart than I have. You know, the hmm. left and right sticks. Yet the sticks remain. And basically, the reason being is because, you know, when you're running, you know, on Call of Duty, as you can see, you don't hear the clicking. And then when it's straight, Maybe the sticks don't come off. <clears throat> so like, maybe they're been, people say that fused really to the axle, being, you know, for lack of a better word for whatever that stick is stick. called. Hmm. Uh, the other being to... Oh, oh, really? Gonna, that sounds yes, idiotic. You know, untightening it as, you know, the maximum as possible. But, you know, that's kind of a problem because, you know, when you're running around, you might want the stick a little bit, 
you know, tight so that it doesn't move around so much. And obviously, if you untighten it just to run around, then, you know, this guy talks a lot. Work. But um, mm. does he say anything or does he just yeah, talk? Even after you completely unloosen this left stick or even the right stick for that matter. Um, Wait, did I see a knife? Where you'll be running I thought I saw a knife. For yeah, a it looks like he gets to start using a knife. I, I should yeah, share this with the you know, if you're playing Call with of the Duty zoo. Or... <clears throat> this guy also plays Call of Duty a lot. Hold on, the, everyone needs to see this. Um, you just link it to me, and I'll link it to them. Or well, no, I I think I'm gonna go ahead and um, turn it on that way. Oh yeah. Okay, so the other game that pretty much you know uses this as the running button. Um, so the way that I found to fix this is, I don't know if you can see it, but right here, let me, uh, let me use my Zacto knife for this. Uh oh, his, his uh, Zacto knife. Go with the Zacto. Yep. I'm using my uh, iPhone 5 camera. The so Zact. I'm kind of surprised Give him the Zact. much better. Right there, where my Zacto knife Dear is. Dear God, what are you doing, right man? Right there. That is the sensor that... Don't you have a probe a little button sensor you could be right using? There. And it basically, when you push it down, as you see here, it pushes down and it makes a little clicking sound. And the reason your character isn't running when you uh, when you tighten up your stick is that when you tighten it or when you tighten it up to make more tension, the stick actually goes up. His you know, his has way here. more play so to it, it than mine does. So it creates less of a pushing point between yeah, his, that his sensor goes way way far. Between this sensor right here. Huh. Jeez. Right there, and the stick that pushes it, which is right above it. You can't really see it, but like, it's there. Also, it sounds um, like he's correcting a different problem. So the way you fix this yeah. is you basically take... All you really want to do is get um, the cap you know, off. Make sure, right. make sure either, there's nothing you know, under a piece of plastic underneath. or... I wouldn't recommend cardboard, but you know, a piece of plastic or even metal. And you just kind of crazy glue it in between mm. there so that no matter how much you tighten your stick up, it will always press down. Let's look um, at something I've else. I've already tested it on this... On How about this stick. Uh, yeah. uh, I've actually gone through two ons already. I'm going uh, to so search around for a 360 controller right here. calibration. And, um, I took it apart. I you have to cut off the, uh, the cable, which is why you know. The, the, yeah, it looks like he never working. actually it's takes the like stick my, off. My, you know, <sighs> my real ons is over there. Hey, this but, this um, video tutorial <clears throat> is only a minute 24 okay, long. Sorry, sorry, everyone. That one that was pretty lame. Uh, it's using the wrong. I tell everything to use my headset, but it's still using my speakers. Okay, this guy is just going to the same menu we went to, only we've confirmed that does nothing. Uh,. Oh, apparently, if you take apart a PlayStation 2 DualShock, it uses the same thing. Um, oh. And you can replace the part. Uh huh. Which. Well, if if that were to happen, I would just say, buy a five dollar thing that will let you use your PlayStation 2 DualShock with uh, your computer. Because that is way less of a pain. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, in the search programs and files box under start, type joy.cpl. Wait, say that again? <laughs> joy.cpl. This is a support.xbox.com thing. Okay, that... Oh, it just, it just that, brings you up there. Yeah, that's a okay. shortcut to that. We've, con we've confirmed right. that this does nothing. Uh... Dark Souls. If you're not satisfied, click settings and then click reset to defaults. When you click, uh... yes, but how can I? Can I change that at all? Okay, so you you can calibrate it, but calibrating doesn't actually do anything. Yeah, we we have seen uh, we've cynic. seen calibration fail. I fixed. Oh, that's something that Lord Cynic has linked a thing you've already found. Ah. Oh, it looks like there's the number five in here. It's like if I dig deep enough, there's just a five. What the hell? 
the five is there because that's how many fingers your hand has. I I don't know. It's like there is oh oh now I've done it. Did I hear a pop? Yeah, I pried the part off. Um, okay. What if I just push that back in? Yeah, it snapped back in. Okay. Did you get the cap off? I can't actually see yeah, anything. I don't, yeah, I, I was doing sketchy stuff, so I, I removed it from view. Ah, that's fair. Because the, um... That axis has a little rotational mechanism. It's a little, um, yellow thing here and I pulled that off and uh, back on and that did uh, nothing nothing because yep that did nothing okay okay the only thing I could think of is that after we reset the thing to default just try it and see if that changes anything in game but I don't think it will what like this Maybe yeah hitting that <laughs> And then okay. Maybe hitting that, and then just trying it in-game to see if it hates it still. You know, just to eliminate options. No, it does not seem to have changed anything. Yeah, that doesn't. Um, maybe I can close Dark Souls for the time being. Maybe that's okay. Uh, perhaps. Oh no, Steam! <laughs> and the game will also yell at you for not closing the game properly. Dark Souls That's... uses not a save feature. Yeah, Maybe okay. not have closed the game properly. Also. Yep, good for it. What is wrong with you, little part? I'm going to pry it off again. Wait. Oh, that's that's actually connected to something down there. Okay. Because what I, what I have here is a plastic housing that it's like I'm not at all squeamish about you know destroying this thing because it's basically non-functional for the one thing I need it for yeah well I guess there's still the fiesta coming up you could use it for that because it doesn't care about your yeah, right stick that that'll be that'll be fine a lot of things that I use this for don't need the right stick for, for anything Wait, yep does that still hold on ugh no matter how much light I have, I never have enough light. That's how it always is. All right. My room's too dark. Mm. Uh huh. Aha! Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Are you eating it? Uh oh. -huh. Uh -huh. <laughs> you you must eat what you have destroyed. Oh, okay. <laughs> Look at Hunter. Necromongers, we keep what we kill. <laughs> I, Necromonger. I, I need the... Boy, I, I really need this, uh, this stick to pop off. And it just... doesn't. So yes, Rosella, every single HD remake they've made of a classic Final Fantasy game has looked like it was made in RPG Maker. I'm willing to bet because maybe they made it in RPG Maker... Like, I watched Lucy stream uh, Final Fantasy IV HD, and that looked awful. Looked yeah, those, those, are, those are really ugly, because they don't understand how pixel art works. Yes. And they just sort of they, turned it into, like, filtered pixel art. Okay. They, they, yeah, they put the filter over it. Duh. Yeah, there is something. There is a physical problem. It is. It is not catching on a little thing. And if I can get the analog stick out of the way, then I will be well, able to. Um, the cap maybe must come fix off. That. <laughs> I, mm. Yeah. Um, and you know, I looked. I looked in there, and it looks. You can see the metal piece in there. I don't know how it's connected, though. What does because it's if it's counter fused on, then yeah, if it's fused on, wait, I'll, how I'll does counterclockwise some... twisting work? Well, it, it has that's that's the thing I'm up against here is it has a little like tightening feature. Oh, where maybe that's can, why it's jam. Yeah, and you can you can adjust the tension in the thing, um, and I think that's full loose.
But I also think that that's why it doesn't just pop off. Yeah, because that's in the way. So, worst comes to worst, that makes it impossible to come off. Uh, Second worst comes to worst is you break that in removing it. Right. But I think that is acceptable losses to get it to work in the first place. Mm Hmm. Hmm. Hold on, what if I... What if I just keep twisting? Because this actually... Oh, boy. <laughs> yeah, just keep twisting it. Yeah. Keep twisting it. Keep, use more force. That, that sounds like a wonderful plan on this delicate piece of electronics. Um... There is another other alternative... What is that, sir? Well, th- see, this, uh, the only thing that's actually in the way is this plastic shield, the little round part. Oh, I could, that, um You could just remove it. I could clip it off. Boy, well, oh boy. I would say if twisting didn't work, that would be a viable option. Because the shield doesn't actually well, do anything. It, it would make it's... my controller permanently uglier. It would. Come on, just find a safe way to hold you tightly. Well, maybe word number. Oop, wait, what's this? Did I feel it? Yes, oh my goodness. Ah, try twisting. Ah, get off there, you son of a bee. Okay, there we go, success. I, I cannot see. Oh, what? Well, I think my I think my uh, stream feed, my Skype feed, uh, froze. Oh, well, I'm it just should watching be on, the stream. Right, right. It should be on the stream. And you're a yeah. little. Uh, the Ta-da. camera is a little uh, above. Right. So there we are. <laughs> my analog pipe. And now we can maybe possibly find a solution, kind of. Okay. Actually, now that I look more closely at it, it doesn't look like anything's wrong. Oh. That's... This saddens me. A little heartbreaking. Right, because this... This is just a physical spring-loaded mechanism in the metal housing here. And yeah. the yellow part here, that's the sensor. So that's detecting a a tilt in that direction. So that's this is what that is wrong. That little son of a bitch right there. It is physically accurate and intact. I think I just I think I figured out how to test for a driver problem. Yep. Do you have a second PC? Um, I have a Linux machine. <laughs> <laughs> that would probably require drivers. Oh, goodness. Infinite things stomping us in our brain. I know. Of every, everything <laughs> is wrong. Dark Souls every, is a hard game. It My is. God. G- geez. Uh, I, what is Xbox 360 Game Pass? Oh, my God. Say? Oh my goodness! Oh, oh no! It's, uh, it's fixed. No. Oh my goodness! It's What's for some reason zoo? fixed. Okay, it's. I mean, it's ugly, but it it's fixed. <laughs> you hmm. just have to play as the skeleton version of your of your game ca- game pad. Oh my god! I want that... I want everyone to see this. Hold on. Everyone needs to see this. I have fixed it. I fixed a you... thing. You need to see. You need to see it. Look at that Y rotation. It actually is working. I wonder if just getting the shell off and wiggling it was what did it. Well, it might have been like picking at the, yeah. Because like the shell might have been restricting it in some fashion. Or there might have been, there might have been a physical problem before I removed it and put it back. So. Who knows? (laughs) You know what? I'll take it. If this means yeah. I get to play Dark Souls and have it not flip out, then I will I will gladly take it. And watch the problem yes. basically restore itself once I 
once I put How much back. are you going to like the game now that you can now that the control works? the game? Oh my yeah. god, I I can hardly wait. Um, Perhaps soon does, you will even oh master boy, the control. Does, yeah, and not like mistakenly drink an Estus flask every second. Because, I did that for the longest time. Oh my god. Because I'm so used to games where, it, like, attack button, and it's like, oh, no, 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 shoot the man with your sword. That's that's what we're doing. Yeah. Well, if, in order to get all the controls to fit on one controller, they had to. Wait, what the hell is this? Huh? I have an extra part. Oh, son of a... God, it's Ikea. Um, <laughs> what is this? This... May I see it? It's a, it's a little washer... Uh, oh, I is just that a grommet to go around the it power. Is. Yeah. No, not not around the um not around the power, but it, to go around the thing that I just set back. Oh. I'm pretty sure that yeah, I can see one of those inside of the other one. So Maybe. I just set it back on, and I'm not gonna worry about it. You know what? Yeah. Screw it. Just a, it's just a grommet. What does it actually do? Yeah, that can't do anything important. Who cares about grommets? Hell, it might have been the thing that was pushing the thing to an angle, and since that fell out... Oh my god, you're kidding me! That could actually be it! This little son <laughs> of a bitch could be the the thing. Oh, M McGinnis. Alright, alright. Now to very carefully set everything back without, like, crushing um, devices. Wait, do I need these yet? Um, L. All right. Where do you maybe, go? Maybe you should eat the grommet. I'm not going to absorb its power. I'm not going to eat the grommet. <laughs> I think engineers are good people because they invent words like dongle and spudgel and grommet. Yeah. Well, this is what years of training in engineering gets you. You you <laughs> want to take everything apart. It's like, oh, something's not working. Hmm. Uh. Something might be physically wrong. Let's see. Let's see if there's a physical problem. That's something well, I can troubleshoot. I'm glad that was actually it and not some bomb driver issue from Windows being shitty. Yeah. Um, How often that is the problem in these sort of problems. Okay, that goes back in carefully. Setting the uh, setting these tiny little boards for the... Um, Oh, God. Good Lord. Yeah, setting back the tiny little boards for the bumpers is very hard. And I haven't... Uh, I need it in my lap to do this. That's why you guys aren't seeing anything, and, and all apologies for that. We get to see right this guild mage some more. He is a happy guy. Yeah, he's he's just... He's loving life. You know what? He's like a... He's a zombie shaman, I think. He'd better be a shaman. Or wait. No, no, no. Guild mages were all wizards. Uh, sh Gruul sh uh, guild mage was definitely a shaman. And so is Rectus Guild Mage. What? Creature. Zombie Shaman. They're supposed to all be wizards, like, as a rule. <laughs> they don't like giving they mess red up their own wizards rule. a lot. I know. Like, I think Young Pyromancer is one of the few red wizards from recent time. Well, they're idiots, and I don't like them for a thousand reasons. Yeah. Rectus Guild Mage is cool, though. He kills things with your lands. Supposed or to really be anything. Come on, get in there. I have I have no way of holding the it? thing, and that's why I have ah okay. Okay, so called? after some careful shoving, I have everything back in place. Um, dead weight was that card? Yeah. Dead weight was Rectus, a good card. Yeah, that's what Rakdos Guild Mage does. Turn your lands into dead weight. But they were already dead weight, and that's why you're discarding them. Uh... Ugh, crud. <laughs> something, something doesn't quite line up in here. Well, hmm. Um... What's Bulgari's elf shaman? Let's find out. Uh, what if, what if it's? Yeah, Golgari Guildmage was also a shaman. Hmm. Yeah, I think the power cable is getting... Not the power, the information cable? The cable. That's getting in my way. The big cable. What guild mages aren't wizards? Delgari guild mage. Gruel guild mage. Like, they're named mage. 
You know, yeah. that's that's the important. Rosda Guild Mage. That's supposed to mean something. Uh, Rakdos Guild Mage, Rick Smotty Guild Mage. How come Selesnia Guild Mage gets to be a wizard, but Golgari Guild Mage doesn't? You know, as soon as I saw Selesnia Guild Mage, I was convinced they were all wizards. Well, Celestia Guild Mage is definitely a wizard. It's like got a staff. Yeah. And like a head made out of wood. That's what, something a wizard what? would do to themselves, right? A head made out of wood? Yeah. Like he's got the Celestial Guild Mage has the weird hat. I thought that was... That looked... Yeah, I thought that was just a hat. Is it a hat or is it its head? It's hard to tell with elves. Yeah. Who really knows? Elves. Me too, Gazi. Guild this Mages. Is, wait, like, wait a second. Celestial Guild Mage is a wizard. V2 Gazi Guild Mages is a shaman. Changing the rules. So, uh, what doesn't fit? Wait. Mm. Ah. No, I finally got it. Oh, okay. great. Hooray. After minutes of shoving, I finally... Oh, now I need to do a different kind of shoving. Ugh, God. What is... What does that part do? Hmm. That looks important. Um. Nope. No idea. Uh, is it actually important or does it just look important? It doesn't look important. Okay, let me let me show you the problem. Um, there's this little soft flap here. Yeah. I, don't, I don't know what's what that's doing, and there is not a matching one on the other side. So I presume it's not important. Hmm. If I had to guess anything, I would guess they would cover the little presser switch under the trigger, but I don't know if that's true Right, or not. but it, it, there's only one of it, and there are two distinct places, and it doesn't neatly line up with either. Maybe so, it's just uh, Chad, then, from yeah, production. I'm like, gonna, it didn't, didn't clip fully boards they were cutting out or whatever? I'm, I'm going to presume it's a Chad. More good words. Chad. Chad. Goodbye, Chad. All these useless components. Look at that. We're, yeah, that we're <laughs> yeah, that looks like a thing like when they were pressing out parts. Because it looks like maybe... I don't know. Who knows? You're making your controller much more efficient. That's how I we am. should look at it this way. <laughs> yeah, I'm streamlining it even further. Okay, that sounds good. Good bit of rebound there. Okay, this has to go over that. Uh, wasn't uh, there a... Oh, yeah, that's going to be a trick, isn't it? You don't get that tattooed there, Squirrel Token. Get I'm more efficient now tattooed over your surgery scar. 20% more efficient now that I'm not pumping energy into my appendix. Hmm. Okay... Please fit back. Wait, how about if I tried... Ah. Aha! Aha! Ah. Okay, now before I screw it back in, I'm going to click and click and click and test. That feels good. Now let's plug it back in and see if it is working. See if it actually works. Right. Oh, what was the joy dot joy dot cpl dot cpl beautiful i love being able to just launch something <laughs> yeah do this in front of your friends to highly impress them um oh son of a wait it has moods uh what does the game think Ugh, I don't think this is going to work. What changed in between putting it all together? Hmm. Hmm. That's, that's suspicious. I mean, it's... Huh. Wait, maybe I can configure it now and it, that will actually do <laughs> something. Uh, perhaps. Which one is the axis? X rotation. 
And they couldn't be clear about this either. Move the Y rotation all the way up and down. Which Y, y rotation? Like, the right stick? The left stick? Right. I mean, you kind of have to figure out what that is from, from this dialog box. Okay, gonna gonna try to calibrate that again, but this time... Z, Z, X, X, Y, um, down. Try to fool it into lowering the the resolution of it there. No, this is uh. This is just going to remain a problem, actually. Look at that. Yep. Oh. It's something physical, though. Because when it had when it had nothing on it, it... It did a little better. Um... Yeah. So we're back to square one. We have a little bit of progress. We know removing everything makes it work. Actually, Which I can... Mean... The, yeah, the weird thing is... I can kind of get it to stick. You see that? If I if I push it up and then sort of let it go, then it decides that a different place is its new like level. Which might be tolerable. Probably not. Well, I I don't actually know what you're doing with the stick right now. I just see I'm, the bar going up and down. Oh, oh, right. Let's. I guess we can put that here and see and nudge it just a tiny little bit. If I pull it down, it immediately pops up to max, and then I can kind of nudge it until it's convinced. Yeah. The thing that bothers me the most is that it keeps flipping violently, like up and yeah. down. Yeah. You know? Like that's a clear sign that there's there is something more wrong with this. Hmm. I'm I may have to for the time being go and borrow a controller. Yeah, that's what so. Burnt had just said. Why doesn't Cass just steal a controller from KFJ's two sixty? Well that would be stealing. Right. And you don't steal from friends. Sometimes. Also, we want to get this working because it's bugaboo that it doesn't work. Right. It's a pretty sweet controller aside from this one thing that is not working. So, uh, I'm going <laughs> to I'm going to put everything back together and I just um, I thought of a single thing. What's that? If you I wonder if the cap that goes on this on the axle, uh, the actual thumb pad cap if something from a different controller would have the same problems, if it would even fit. What do you mean? Like taking like a. Uh, never mind. It's not worth considering. I was thinking of like putting a regular 360 controller thumb pad on the uh, whole stick mechanism instead of the thing that tightens and loosens. Hmm. Because I think that might be the problem. Is that mechanism? What would be nice is if I could configure the game to just not bother yeah that would be really that'd be really nice but this port was rushed and made by a company who had never made a pc game before Hooray. so it is very bad <laughs> very Hooray. bad so i shouldn't be playing it on steam is what you're getting at oh uh, is dark souls 2 any better uh, Dark Souls 2 is much better. Okay. Um, for you, one... you want to know what else? I forgot to uh, attach some other screws inside. So I have, oh. I have some missing screws in there. I hope that doesn't... Uh... I hope uh, that doesn't tinge... get in the way of my fun. Uh, what tinged is that, Rosella? She's talking about having a tinged. Tinged? I think that's hype. Tinged. Okay. Oh, right. She has tinged. one of my controllers. Ah. So until she completes the tinged, I can't have that controller back. Looks like a Celtic word. It's a wonderful word. Mm. I will look up its etymology. It's what she has earned for making me play Dragonage. 
Dragon Age. Yeah. Uh, this is definitely a Celtic. Is it's Welsh? I knew it. Yep. Y, y means Welsh. Plural. Tingid who? Tingid do. Is the oh, hear... it's guys. I just Welsh for guys. Okay. Yeah. So there, here we have all of my parts and tools. And I guess for the time being, I am going to get a different controller and use something else and be sad that my Gins. awesome controller doesn't actually do for this. I really wish that existed. Welsh.wikipedia.com. <laughs> actually, I want to look. Is there such a thing as a Welsh Wikipedia? All right. Well, um, thanks everybody for joining me. We had a lot of fun. Sadly, this controller will not be joining us for the rest of Dark Souls. <sighs> Rip in peace. Yep. There. You know what? You play until you die. <laughs> you play after that. You keep playing. Death will not stop you. Also, there is a, Sc a Welsh wiki, but it's in Welsh, which, unlike Scottish, is not a funny, jokey version of English, but is an actual language with rules and things. <laughs> All right, well, uh, I'm going to continue to clean up here and be back in a little bit with actual game, probably. So hopefully. <laughs> hopefully. <laughs> hopefully. Oh, well, uh, thanks, thanks, Doom, for helping me out and talking about things. I am sad I could not help. for bearing with me while I um, fix something, and uh, I'll be back later. Skulls. <laughs>